Good evening, folks. I'm your host, Caden Reif, and welcome to another installment of Super Mega Baseball 2022. We are here for the first of the true playoff series following the tiebreaker game 163 between Tampa Bay and Toronto. Sent Tampa Bay to the wildcard series here for the first of many playoff series to come. Here to face the Houston Astros in a three-game set in Tampa Bay for the chance to advance to the American League Division Series to face the Toronto Blue Jays, second seed division winner in the AL. And it is going to be a tough, tough matchup between these two teams to decide who advances on into the ALDS. But without further ado, going to immediately take you in and get started here in game number one in Tampa Bay. Looking at the Houston Astros lineup, it is as you would expect facing a righty here with Jose Altuve to lead off. Alex Bregman will be batting in second, the third baseman. Kyle Tucker will be starting in right, and Jordan Alvarez will be in left, the most dangerous hitter on this Houston Astros team and one of the MVP candidates. Michael Brantley DHing, he'll bat fifth, as well as Aledemus Diaz in this lineup. He'll be in sixth, playing first base. The utility man get, get some regular starting time here. Francis Cruz, the catcher. A midseason acquisition from Houston will be batting in the seventh spot. Jeremy Pena, the shortstop, will be eighth, and Jose Siri, the center fielder, in ninth. And one of the Cy Young favorites, Justin Verlander, will be the starting pitcher for game one here in Tampa. So no surprises there out of that lineup. Gonna need to make some changes here, though, to this lineup since this is loaded with lefties for the tiebreaker game I did not change this so we're gonna make a change to this real fast and I'll come back to you when we have that changed alrighty so we are back here with the Tampa Bay lineup it will be Jose Caballero and Yandy Diaz leading off one and two for Tampa Bay as was the case in the game against Toronto Harold Ramirez will be DHing and batting in the three hole spot and Al Sampson the third baseman will be fourth Manuel Margot will bat fifth, the right fielder, and left fielder Arosa Reyna will be in this game as well. Brandon Lowe will be getting the start at second over Kanan, with Kiermaier in center, and Mike Zanino will start as catcher in this game over Mejia, who started in the tiebreaker game. And with Shane McClanahan having pitched the tiebreaker game against Toronto, it will be Jeffrey Springs getting the nod first here in the wildcard series against these Houston Astros at home. But without further ado, we're going to take you to the field here for the first of three here in Tampa Bay for the first of the wildcard series here for AL wildcard series number one. Playoff baseball getting set to get underway. It will be Jose Altuve leading off against Springs here in Tampa under the lights for game number one of potentially three. All of these games getting played here in Tampa. Altuve to lead off here tonight against the Lefty Springs. Outside. Deep ride. Ball outside. Three. Swing and a miss there. The count goes to two and two as here Springs' pitch. High fly ball pulled foul down the left field line. We'll do it again. And now Tuve takes strike three. Springs starts this game off with a strikeout. Alex Bregman in, batting in the two hole for the Astros. Swing and a miss there off the plate. Who's the 1 1? Fly ball to center. Kiermeyer not deep. He'll track it down and make the catch for out number two. And they're quickly two down here as Kyle Tucker steps in to bat third. Lefty on lefty matchup as Tucker. Shoots it foul, opposite field down the left field line. Swing and a miss at the changeup. Here's a 1 2 pitch now. Checked his swing, another pitch. 2 2. On the ground and through the middle for a base hit as Kyle Tucker is aboard with a two out single. The first hit here in the ball game for Houston as Jordan Alvarez steps up to the plate. One of three American League hitters tied with the 146 OPS plus the highest in the AL. One of the most dangerous hitters in the league as he is quickly ahead 3-0 on Springs. Here's the pitch. Fouled off down the 
third base line. Ball four. And he'll take ball four, so two on and two out here. DH Michael Brantley up to the plate. And he pops it up first pitch. Diaz will settle under it. And he'll put the squeeze on it for out number three. Early traffic, nothing going for Houston. And the first inning is scoreless for them as we head to the bottom half of the first. Jose Caballero will lead off for Tampa Bay. He fouls off a first offering. Inside. Two and two the count. That's low. And Caballero works the count full on Verlander. Here's the pitch. Foul down the third base line once again. Another 32. And he walked him. Caballero with a leadoff walk here in the first for Tampa Bay. Yandy Diaz up to the plate. One of the best contact hitters in the game here. Taking off on the first pitch is Caballero. The throw down to second. The tag is not in time. And a stolen base on the first pitch for Caballero. Puts a runner in scoring position here for Tampa early on with Diaz at the plate. The 1 2 pitch is fouled off. 2 2 the count now. Tough guy to fan is Yandy. Just up. Payoff pitch once again. Verlander having to work early. Here's the 3 2. Down the third base line, a fair ball into the corner. Caballero is going to make the turn, and with nobody out and the first two batters into the game for Tampa, it is one nothing Rays here over Houston and Justin Verlander as they take the early lead. Yandy Diaz with an RBI single down the left field line, and he's going to take off. Ramirez fouls it off. One two the count. Pitch is up and out for ball two. Here's a 2 2. Fouled off once again. Another try. Fouled off once more. Ramirez staying alive. Here's a third straight 2 2. And through the left side for a base hit. Three straight base runners here for Tampa in the first. Verlander having a tough go around to start out this game, and Al Sampson steps to the plate. One of the finalists for the third baseman Silver Slugger Award this year. Batting in the cleanup spot, and he pops it right to Altuve, and it is a 4-6-3 double play. Ramirez, excuse me, Diaz advances to third base, and now two out for Manuel Margot. He fouls off the first offering down the third base line. Ball inside. Verlander really having to work early up to 25 pitches now. He's ahead. 2-2 on Amargo. The pitch. Up and into right field for a base hit. 2-0 Tampa Bay as Amargo with a single here in the first. Verlander's first inning continues to crumble apart. And that brings a Rosarena to the plate with two out. Runner taken off. Margot, the throw down, not in time. Second stolen base against Cruz here in the first. This inning continues to be disastrous for Houston as that one goes into center field for a base hit. Margot's being waved home. The throw home is cut off. 3 0 Tampa Bay here in the first. That'll bring up Brandon Lowe now, the second baseman up to the plate, and the seventh man to the dish against Verlander in the first. Pickoff move, first move. And another runner taking off. And there's a third straight stolen base here in the first. Tampa Bay laying it on Verlander, but the next pitch is grounded to Pena, and that'll do it. Three runs and three stolen bases for Tampa Bay in the first. It's 3 0 Rays after just one frame. We head to the top of the second. Elenimus Diaz will lead off with Jeffrey Springs still on the mound. That's inside. Springs a lengthy rest there in the second and line right to Caballero. He'll make the underhanded catch for out number one. As Diaz lights out, here's Cruz, the catcher. And he lines it into left center field for a base hit. Kiermaier will track it down in the gap and hold Cruz to a single. 
With one down here in the second, that'll bring up Jeremy Pena, the shortstop. And he shoots it. Caballero, a diving stop. The throw will not be in time, as it'll be down to second base. He is in safe in plenty of time. Jose Siri now to the plate. Offering a swing and a miss. Payoff pitch now to Siri. 3 2. Struck him out looking, and Springs has another K. That'll bring up Jose Altuve. Two out and two on here. Jose Altuve represents the tying run early. Looking to claw back a little bit here. He takes the first two pitches off the plate for ball one and two. His knee too low, and that is in there for a strike. On the ground, Diaz, he'll take it himself, and a couple of base runners, doesn't matter, Houston, no runs through two. We head to the bottom half, Kiermaier, Zunino, and Caballero do up against Verlander. Verlander really struggled in that first inning. He looks to get back to work as Kiermaier swings and misses at the first offering. Nope, inside. Swing and a miss, and Verlander has a strikeout. Kiermaier retired to lead off here in the second. Here's power threat catcher Mike Zanino. And he lines it into center field for a base hit on the first hit. Serial collect it quickly. Another base hit here for Tampa, their fifth of this ball game, as Caballero heads to the plate for the second time already here in the second. 37 pitches for Verlander here through one and a third. Caballero behind 0-2. Here's a pitch. Not an easy guy to fan. Caballero going to try to stay alive. Fouls off a couple 0-2 offerings. The next pitch. Caught him looking. Caballero did not like the call, and that is out number two here in the second. A couple of strikeouts. Verlander to face Diaz. Single to drive in Caballero this last time. He works ahead, 3-0. Who's pitch? Badass. Strike number one, and works the count back full. Payoff pitch. Offering to Diaz, runner goes on the ground. Bregman on the short hop, and he'll throw it over for out number three. That'll do it. No extra runs here for Tampa in the second, despite the base runner. We head to the top of the third. Bregman to lead off with Tucker and Alvarez to follow. The third baseman, number two. Springs working around traffic early. First pitch is a strike to Bregman. Bregman pops it up. Caballero, he'll settle under it. Gets the beat on it as he records out number one. I'll bring up Kyle Tucker quickly. One for one with a single. Little flare into shallow left center, but Caballero will get under it. Is he over there short? He records out number two. That'll bring up Jordan Alvarez with two down here in the third. Alvarez pops it over to Caballero. He'll throw it across, and it'll be in time. Caballero records all three outs. We head to the bottom of the third quickly. 3-0 Tampa. Harold Ramirez will lead off here. Verlander trying to get back in a groove. He's thrown 48 through 2. Tough work for the Cy Young leader. But he's ahead 0-2 on Ramirez. Here's a pitch. Inside for ball one on the ground, and Bregman can't get it. That's a fair ball down the left field line. Another single here, as Ramirez has got two of them now. Bring up Al Sampson. Number 17. With nobody out and a runner on. Curveball for a strike, first pitch. Swing and a miss. Sampson behind here. Here's the pitch to him. 
Down low for ball one. One, two. Fouled it off. Sampson skies it. Left center field. Alvarez will settle under it, and he'll make the catch for out number one. Ramirez retreats. One down. Here's Margot with an RBI single his last time. A lot of base running activity against Petra Cruz in this game. We'll see if Ramirez tries to run. Margot behind. 1-2. Here's the pitch from Verlander. On the ground, Altuve to second for one, and they will not get the out at first. It's a fielder's choice. Two down, here's a Rosarena. Pickoff move right away on Margot. Runner take it off. Margot trying to get a stolen base. He's in there. Four stolen bases in the game here. Landers 0-2. Down low. Popped over Verlander. Pena the throw in time. That'll do it. Nifty little play there. Short by Pena. And we head to the top of the fourth. 3-0 Tampa. Brantley up to the dish now. That's outside. Swing and a miss. Here's a 1-2, 2-1 two, two, pitch, excuse me, now 2-2. Two, two. Pitch to Brantley. Popped up foul, that'll get out of play. 2-2 two, two again is down low for ball three. Payoff pitch here to Brantley. Fouled off again. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Brantley not an easy guy to fan, but he's down swinging. Lead off K here in the fourth for Houston as Springs gets to work on Diaz. One and one the count quickly here. Swing and a miss. One, two. High fly ball to center. Backing up is Kiermaier on the track, and he'll make the catch for out number two. Cruise to the plate now, one for one with a single. And he takes strike one. Popped on the ground. Sampson, tough play. He makes it for out number three. Houston down in order here in the fourth. We head to the bottom of the fourth. Three nothing Rays still. Low Kiermaier Zanino here in the fourth. Seven, eight, nine. You up. Number eight. Lefty low 0 for 1. Behind 0 2 on Verlander, his pitch. Tapper, Pena. And he makes another quick throw for out number 1. Low is retired. That'll bring up Kevin Kiermeyer with one down. On the ground, Bregman. Over to first in time for out number two. Two down here. Here's Mike Zanino. 70 pitches. High fly ball down the right field line, but hooking just foul. Zanino narrowly misses out on a home run. Verlander working way outside. Be a little rattled by that deep fly ball. Here's a 3 1. Swing and a miss. Payoff with two down here to Zanino. Here's the pitch from Verlander, and he lost him. Zanino is aboard here with two down for Caballero. Walk to lead off this ballgame. Caught him looking once again. Second K for Caballero. He's down looking once more. We head to the top of the fifth. Pena to lead off here. Pitchers have been working hard today. It's been 57 pitches through four for Springs. 
He faces Pena and works ahead 0-2 immediately. Here's the pitch. Just inside. Pena with a good eye. Here's a 2-2. Fouled off. Popped foul once again. A couple of foul balls in a row. Here's another 2-2 to Pena. Struck him out. Down swinging is Pena. Off man retired once again here by Springs. Siri digs in now with one down. He looks at strike one. And strike two. 0 2 pitch to Siri. Struck him out. Back to back strikeouts here in the fifth for Springs. Altuve up with two down. He's 0 for two. On the ground, low. First pitch over to his left, and that'll do it here in the fifth for Houston. We have the bottom half, Diaz, Ramirez, Sampson, the damage doers do up for the Rays here. The first baseman, number two. Verlander, 80 pitches through four. He's going to have to work. And Diaz sends it deep to center field, backing up and gone! That one will fly away for a home run. Yandy Diaz with a scorch shot to center field. Had to be over 110 off the bat there as that was a low sailing home run. And Siri could not make the catch. It's 4-0 Tampa Bay now. Ramirez taps it foul. 1-2 the count on him. Here's the pitch. He's 2-for-2. Two two. He's caught him looking on the slow curve. And there's a strikeout for Verlander. One down, and that will do it for Justin Verlander after just four and a third. That'll bring up Christian Javier to pitch. Long relief here. Swing and a miss. And that one is going to find some grass in right field for a base hit. Al Sampson has himself a knock. One down here. That'll bring up Margot. And he pulls it foul. First pitch. Way behind. Here's the 1-2 from Javier. The pitch. On the ground. Pinning you. Over to Altuve for one. And they will get the double play. A nice scoop by Diaz there. That'll do it in the fifth for Tampa Bay, but they got another run on the Yandy Diaz home run. It is 4-0 Tampa. Springs gives up a hit to Bregman on the first pitch that he sees. That one finds some grass in center, and Houston has a base runner to lead off here. Number 30. Jeffrey Springs, 69 pitches thrown, and he gets to work against Tucker. Lefty on lefty. Go inside. Just inside for ball two. Here's a 2 0. In a right center field and caught out there by Margot. Nice rundown catch there, and he robs Tucker of what could have been extra bases. That'll bring up Alvarez with one on and one out. Houston needing some magic as this game winds down, and Alvarez skies it way out of here. Second deck for Alvarez to left center field. A long home run, 460 feet. Houston not quite out of this as Alvarez launches a long home run. The designated hitter, number 23. Swings' his first runs given up in this ball game. 4-2 Tampa Bay as Alvarez brings Houston back within striking distance. Bregman back to work, 1-2 against Springs, the pitch. Fouled off. The 1-2. Fouled off once again. Do it one more time. Outside for ball two. Brantley working, the payoff. Yeah, up and into center field for a base hit. Kiermaier collects it. Another base knock. Here for Houston. Springs running into trouble here. They're going to let him continue to work. He's thrown 81. Diaz digs in. That's low. 
The one two fouled off. One two pitch. Down low. Spring is still running into trouble, having to work here. Payoff pitch now to Diaz. The three two. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Springs with another K. Cruz up to the dish. Two down here. And he looks at strike one. One one the count. Springs looking to get out of this sixth inning. Cruz trying to keep the train rolling. One two. Just checked his swing. Here's a two two offering. Ball, Works the count full with two outs. The pitch. High fly to right center. Back it up at the wall. It is gone. Francis Cruz flies one out of here, and we are tied here in Tampa Bay. Houston right back in it as Francis Cruz hits a two run home run. The second this inning by Houston. Jeffrey Springs with his second home run given up. We head up against Pena now, and he stays in the game nearing 100 pitches. The 1 2 to Pena, the pitch. 2 2, trying to fan Pena for the second time today. On the ground, Caballero, tough play. In time for out number three. But Houston gets four runs in the inning, and we are all tied up here through five and a half. We head to the bottom of the sixth. Randy Arozarena to lead off. Javier going to have to work here. Fouled off. The 1 2. Struck him out. Rosarena down swinging. Lead off strikeout. Javier's first K on the mound tonight. Lowe looks at strike one and ball one and strike two. Here's the one two offering from Javier. Way inside the ball two. Protection swing is another two two. Foul off again down the third base line. Another pitch. And another one fouled off. Low staying alive. Works the count full. Here's the pitch. High fly ball, and that will get fouled. Another 3 2. Fouled off again. Low working the count here. Here's another 3 2, and he draws a walk. Amazing at bat there by Low to bring out Kiermeyer. One down here in the six, and G-Man Choi will pinch hit here for Kiermaier. Played as the DH in the tiebreaker game with Toronto. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Foul. 1-2 one, the count. Pitch. Struck him out. Second strikeout of the inning by Javier as Manchoy is down swinging. And here's power threat Zanino. One for one with a walk and a single. On the ground. Javier couldn't glove it. Pena trying to get him. Got him in time. Out number three as Zanino couldn't run it out. 4-4 four, four the score through six. We head to the top of the seventh. 9-1-2 due up for Houston. And Jason Adam will now come in in relief. Josh Lowe will take over in center field for Kiermaier after G-Man Choi can fit for him. Adam to work. One, two. Struggy Mount looking. Siri down on strikes. Two bay down to the dish. Altuve 0 for 3 today. Looking to create some magic here. 2-1. Two, 2-2 one. Two, two to count on the swing and miss. Fouled off. Another 2-2. Two, two. Fouled off again. High fly to right field. Back at the wall. It is off the very top of the wall. 
Altuve missed a home run to take the lead by about five feet. And he has to settle for a long, long single. Bregman steps to the dish. Oh, two now. Bregman behind, gonna have to work. Here's the pitch. Struck him out on three pitches. Bregman down swinging, two down. Here's Kyle Tucker with the go-ahead run on first. High fly ball, deep to right field, that is gone! Kyle Tucker, another two-run home run for Houston and the Astros have taken the lead! Kyle Tucker with a home run and Houston is on top six to four. Two out magic and Houston has the lead. Payoff pitch to Alvarez from Adam. Popped foul, that'll get out of play. Here's another 3-2. And he walked him. Alvarez is aboard once again. Brantley now to the plate. The 0-2. Fouled off. Brantley trying to stay alive and keep this thing rolling. Another foul ball, staying alive. Here's another 0-2. On the ground, Sampson over to first in time, and that'll do it. Houston takes the lead, another two-run home run. Kyle Tucker sends one out. We head to the bottom of the seventh. The Rays now having to work from behind despite the early lead. Number seven. Jose Caballero to lead off. And he sends one through the left side, a base hit. Alvarez will get it in. Jose Caballero with a leadoff single. Yandy Diaz now to the plate. He's been hot today. Two for three with a home run and a single and two RBI. He looks at strike one. Runner taking off. Pitch out though and he is out. Caballero caught stealing. Cruz guns one down. One, two, the count on Diaz, and he fouls it off. Base runner is erased. Tampa Bay running out of time to claw this one back after Houston came all the way back. Diaz working, still 2-2. Two -two. Here's another pitch. Fouled off again. And again, Diaz... Staying alive and caught looking as Javier finally fans and Diaz down on strikes. Here's Harold Ramirez with two outs. Wave and a miss way upstairs. And he's quickly behind 0-2. Pitch from Javier. And over the head of Diaz. That one scoots in a right for a base hit. Tucker will get it in. It's just going to be a long single. But another base runner for Tampa Bay as Sampson steps to the plate now. With two out, looking for some magic. Sampson represents the tying run. One of the most dangerous bats in the AL at the plate. A pickoff move. Runner is safe. Fouled off. One, two, the count. Gonna have to work. Here's the pitch. Off just got a piece. Another one, two. In the dirt, that one gets away, and Ramirez will advance to second base. Fifth run in scoring position now for Sampson. Here's the two, two. Swing and a miss, struck him out. Sampson down swinging. We head to the top of the eighth. Six four, Houston. The first baseman, number 16. Aledemus Diaz leads off. Adams stays in. Three and one the count. 
Pitch to Diaz, fouled off. Struck him out. Diaz down swinging for out number one. Here's Cruz. And that'll be it for Adam. Alex Rasmussen steps into this ball game to try and prevent further bleeding. Two-two the count on Cruz. Here's the pitch from Rasmussen. Shot fouled on the first baseline. And that one will find some grass in left field as Cruz is aboard for the third time tonight. Three for four. Here's Pena now. Number three. Runner taking off. Here's the throw in the dirt, and Cruz with a stolen base. Getting some revenge on Tampa in scoring position now for Pena as he is going to try and drive him in. Three one to Pena. He's pitch fouled off. Full count now. On the ground, low over to first. Quick toss for out number two. Runner advances to third base for Siri. He's 0 for three today. One, two, the count. Here's the pitch. He caught him looking. Strike three. Siri down on strikes. We head to the bottom of the eighth. 6 4 Houston with Margot to lead off. Fielder, number 13. High fly to center. And settling under it is Siri. He'll make the catch for out number one. Here is a Rosarena. He swings and misses at the first offering as Javier continues to dig deep. Three innings pitched. Almost 60 pitches now. Swing and a miss. Here's the 2-2. Two -two. Payoff pitch to a Rosarena. Little flare left field. That will fall in for a base hit in front of Alvarez. And there's a base knock for a Rosarena. Low represents the tying run at the plate. Speedy runner on the base pass and a quick pickoff move. This could be Javier's last batter. Runner taking off. Here's the throw. Not in time. Another stolen base in this ball game. And he's gonna take off for third. Here's the throw, he's safe. Margot with a pair of stolen bases. And he advances to third. Low down swinging, so no sack fly. I'll bring up Josh Low now for the first time in this game. One, two, the count on low. The pitch outside. Popped up, center field, and Altuve will get under it, and that is out number three. We head to the bottom, or excuse me, the top of the ninth. Houston leads 6 4, looking for some insurance with the top three due up. Baseman, number 27. way to lead off here against Rasmussen who will have to dig deep and there's a little blooper and that will get into center field for a base hit low throws it in quick Bregman down to the dish as Altuve reaches as the leadoff man Rasmussen stays in got off 1-1. One, one. And that one will be low. And there is a stolen base attempt and fouled off. Altuve is forced to retreat. Here's a 2-2. Two, two. On the ground. And booted by low and into right field. Altuve is going to make the turn and go to third. And he will be in there as low boots it. The right fielder, number 30. 
Runners on the corners and nobody out. Here is Kyle Tucker with the go-ahead two-run blast just a few innings ago. Rasmussen stays in. Two two. That one down low. It's going to be a payoff here. The pitch. And a left. Backing up out there is a Rosarena. He'll make the catch. Runner will tag. And Altuve is going to score. 7 4 Houston. Alvarez to the plate. And Whistler will step into the game. Whistler to face Alvarez. That's up. He looks at ball one and strike one. Swing and a miss. One, two, the pitch to Alvarez. High fly to center. That is going to find Green out there and will fall for a base hit. Low will collect it. Runner will be held at third. Runners on the corners and only one out here. As Houston continuing to try and tack on. Brantley now to the plate, one for four. Swing and a miss way inside. Here's the 0-2 oh pitch to Brantley. Popped up, shallow right, falling quickly. What a sliding grab by Margot. Prevented a run scoring. Number 16. And there is two down now with that grab. Here is Diaz at the plate. Fouled off. 0 oh, 2, the pitch. Nope, inside. 1 2 now. And into center field for a base hit. 8 4, Houston. The Astros continue to add on. Number 61. And here is Cruz, 3 for 4, with a home run and two singles. Lined left field, that is going to find the wall for a base hit. Run comes home, nine to four Houston with Cruz, four for five. He's got himself two singles, a double and a home run. What a game for Francis Cruz here. Pena in now. Weissler still trying to get that final out. Taps, Zanino, fair ball, and that'll do it in the third. Houston leads by five. Tampa going to need a miracle here if they want to win this game. Houston looking to take the opener on the road as Ryan Stanek will come into the game to try to close this thing out. Dubon will take over in left over Alvarez. Swing and a miss. Way inside. Zanino nearly got tagged by that one. And another swing and a miss. He's the one two from Stanek. Pitch. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Zanino down swinging. And there's one down here. Here's Caballero. Number seven. Smacked but foul down the first baseline. Way outside. Caballero behind, gonna have to work, here's a 1-2. And a fair ball into the right field corner for a base hit. Caballero thinking about a double, bobbled out there by Tucker, and he is gonna be in with a double. Caballero at second, trying to keep this train rolling and keep the hopes alive as Diaz steps to the plate. Two for four with a home run. The 3 1. Works the count full. Here's the payoff to Diaz. Struck him out. Two down here in the ninth. Harold Ramirez, the last hope here for Tampa to try and keep it rolling. Three for four with three singles. Two 
two and zero, oh, and now three and zero oh to Ramirez. Pitch. There's a strike. Three and one. That one is fouled off. Down to their last strike. The three-two payoff pitch. Ripped foul down the third base line once again. Another three-two, and he walked him. The train continues. Ramirez is aboard. Al Sampson now to the plate. Dangerous hitter. A home run here would make it nine to seven. This game close to out of reach, but not done yet. Two and zero oh to Sampson. Swing and a miss. And take strike two down to the last strike again. Here is the 2-2 pitch from Stanton. Up and in. Payoff with two on and two out. Walked him. What a take by Sampson. And the bases are loaded against Margot. Stanton trying to get out of it. One and one. Two and one now. Broken bat right to Stanek. That'll do it. Houston closes it out. They win here in Tampa Bay and take the opener in the wild card series with a large comeback victory. Nine to four, the final score. And that is going to do it for this first game in the wild card series. Kyle Tucker with the clutch home run, but Francis Cruz will be the MVP of this game. And that'll do it for game number one. We'll take you to the lineup cards in game number two with the Rays trying to stay alive here at home against the Astros. So the game two lineup for the Houston Astros is going to look like this with Altuve continuing to lead off. Francis Cruz will move to second in the batting order and will be playing at first base for this game with Houston taking the defense of Martin Maldonado behind the dish at catcher for this game. He will be batting ninth. McCormick will take over for Siri and bat eighth in center field. Bregman has been demoted to seventh and third and fourth are still Tucker and Alvarez. And the lefty Framber Valdez will be getting the nod for the starting job for this game as Houston looks to try and advance the ALDS to face Toronto. And the starting lineup for Tampa is much of the same as they face the lefty on the mound this time in the form of Valdez. It will be Caballero leading off and Diaz. The entirety of the lineup for the most part is going to be the same here, although Zanino batting 8th, Kiermaier ninth, And yeah, pretty much the same for them, although Rasmussen will be getting the nod to start this game. Shane McClanahan... Again, the starter in the game 163. There was a long debate on if they were going to start him or not, but Rasmussen will be the one on the mound for this one. And that is your starting lineups for the game number two with Tampa Bay trying to force game three in their home stadium. And we take you to the ballpark for game number two here in Tampa. Here in Tampa Bay for game two of potentially three in the AL wildcard series between the Houston Astros and Tampa Bay Rays. As Jose Altuve will lead off here against Drew Rasmussen here in the first. And he fouls off the first offering he sees and we are underway. Rasmussen quickly ahead. Oh, two. Here's a pitch. Fouled off again. Three straight foul balls. And Altuve down swinging. There's a strikeout to start this ball game for Rasmussen. Francis Cruz now to the plate. And he breaks his bat on the first swing, a foul ball. Two and two, the count now on Cruz. The pitch is fouled off again. A lot of foul ball contact here. Just up. Full count now on Cruz. Here's the pitch. And he skies it deep to left field. Way back, way gone. one nothing Houston. Two batters into the game as Francis Cruz stays hot. His second home run of the postseason in as many games. And Houston is on top early here in Tampa Bay.
On the ground to Sampson is Tucker, and there's out number two. Francis Cruz going oppo a long way for a home run. And here is Jordan Alvarez with two down. Getting to work against Rasmussen, who's a 2-2 on the ground. Diving stop, couldn't glove it as Caballero. The throw across is not in time. Jordan Alvarez has himself an infield single, and the traffic continues for Houston here in the first as Brantley steps to the plate now. And he pops it on the ground, first pitch to low. Over to his left for out number three. That'll do it, but Francis Cruz with a long home run to set the tone early. Houston leads 1-0 after just half a frame. And Jose Caballero will lead off here against Valdez. Big lefty up on the mound here for Houston. One of the most fearsome rotations in the league. And you can see why as Caballero is down looking on strikes. That'll bring up Yandy Diaz. Had a home run last night, a solo shot to make it four to nothing before the lead crumbled apart. He's behind 0-2, here's the pitch. On the ground and foul down the first base line, gonna do it again. He struck him out, back-to-back -back strikeouts open the game for Valdez. That'll bring up Manuel Margot. Margot trying to stay alive. And he struck him out. Valdez strikes out the side to start this ball game. 1-0 Houston after one as the Rays go down in order, all striking out. Jeremy Pena to the plate now. He swings and misses at the first offering from Rasmussen. High fly to center. And Kiermaier out there and he'll make the catch for out number one. Leadoff man retired. Alex Bregman down to the plate. On the ground, Rasmussen a nifty grab, and he throws it across for out number two. That'll bring up Chaz McCormick, the center fielder. He takes strike one. And through the right side for a base hit. That one will roll all the way to the wall. McCormick will think about a double, but shut it down there with the arm of Kiermaier. And a two-out single that will bring up Martin Maldonado with two down here in the second. And he pops it up back this way, and that will get out of play. Swing and a miss. He's a one-two. Long hold. And he struck him out. Maltino Maldonado down swinging, and that'll do it in the second for Houston. A hit, but nothing going further than that. One nothing still the score as Sampson digs in now. Lefty on lefty as he faces Valdez. On the ground sharply to Altuve, who makes the underhanded catch for out number one. Harold Ramirez now to the plate. Two to the count now on Ramirez. Here's the pitch. Fouled off. And he struck him out. Another K for Valdez. That'll be his fourth. And Randy Rosarena now to the plate. Who skies it deep to right center. Backing up at the wall. It is off the top of the fence. A Rosarena narrowly misses out on a home run. And that is the first hit of the ball game for Tampa as he hits a long double. Brandon Lowe now to the plate as a Rosarena gets the lead off second. Tapped on the ground, Valdez couldn't glove it. The throw to first is in time. And that'll do it in the second for Tampa despite the long double.
Rosarena narrowly misses out on tying the game. Houston breathes a sigh of relief as we head to the top of the third. Swing and a miss is Altuve. He's the 0-2 pitch. On the ground, diving stop, Caballero. The throw to first is in time. A nice play by Jose over there at short. And Altuve is retired for the second straight time. That'll bring up Francis Cruz. With that long home run. And he shoots it up the middle, a base hit. Francis Cruz on fire here today. His second hit of this ball game. Kyle Tucker to the plate now. One and one, the count on him. He taps it. Rasmussen will throw to second for one. The throw to first is in time for the double play. Tampa gets out of it despite Cruz staying hot. Bottom of the third, one nothing Houston. Zanino, Kiermaier, and Caballero do up. Number 10. So, you know, with the ability to put a big swing on it, he lines it to center first pitch, but on the track is McCormick, and he will make the catch for a loud out number one. I bring up Kevin Kiermeyer with one down. He's quickly behind 0 2 on Valdez. Here's the pitch. Struck him out. Another strikeout for Valdez, who is absolutely rolling through this Tampa Bay lineup today. His fifth of this ball game. He now faces Caballero, who floats it to left. Coming on is Pena to make the catch. He goes out for it, and that'll do it in the third for Tampa. A quick ball game so far. Top of the fourth. One nothing. Houston has Alvarez steps to the plate. Quickly behind 2-0 is Rasmussen. He falls behind 3-0 on Alvarez. Here's the pitch. On the ground, and low cannot glove it. That one's in the center field for a base hit. Alvarez has himself a single to lead off here in the fourth. That will bring up Michael Brantley. He pops it up. Foul ground. Zanino's got a beat on it. And he'll make the catch for out number one. And here's Pena with one down and a runner on first. The 0 2. Pitch. Struck him out looking, and Pena's called out on strikes. The third baseman, number two. I'll bring up Bregman with two down. One and one now on Bregman after that foul ball, and he shoots it through the left side of base hit. Another knock for Houston here. We head with two down and two on. It'll be Chaz McCormick, one for one with a single, looking to add on with two outs. Rasmussen trying to keep any further trouble from brewing. The 0-2 pitch to McCormick. Popped up foul ground. Sampson will get under it, and that will do it. Houston leaves two in the fourth. We head to the bottom half, one nothing Astros. Yandy Diaz to lead off here in the fourth. Fouls off the first offering he sees. down the third base line, the 1-2 pitch to Diaz. On the ground, Bregman. Across the diamond, and there in time for out number one. Diaz retired the lead off. Only one base runner so far for Tampa. Manuel Margot digs in now. Here's the 0-2. In the dirt for ball one, gonna do it again. 
pitch. Swing and a miss at the breaking ball down to the dirt, and Margot is retired. Big wave and a miss. Two down now. Here is Al Sampson for the second time today. And he fouls off that offering and a swing and a miss at the next, the 1 2. Sampson staying alive, do it again. Way inside, payoff now. Pop foul once again, Sampson trying to work something here, fouls off another one. Long at bat here for the third baseman and he takes a walk, second base runner in this ball game for Tampa as Sampson is aboard for Harold Ramirez. Wave and a miss. 1-1 one, one pitch. He is pulled foul on the third base side. The 1-2 two with two out. Just got a piece and fouled it off again. Struck him out. That'll do it for Tampa in the fourth. Still nothing going. We head to the top of the fifth. Houston still leading. Top of the fifth, it'll be Maldonado to lead off. Oh, two pitch on him from Rasmussen. Struck him out. Another strikeout for Rasmussen here as the lineup card turns over again. Altuve for the third time. Over two with a strikeout and a field out. Pitch is fouled off. Going to do it again. Just inside. A good take for Valtuve. Going to do it again. That one. Fair ball down the first baseline. And bobbled out there by Margot in right. And Altuve is going to slide in with a double after that one. Heads up base running by, by Altuve as Margot did not get a hold on it. Now Cruz, two for two with a home run and a single, and he taps it on the ground. Sampson, and he'll throw it across, route number two. Now here's Kyle Tucker. Two down, need and out here. And Tucker takes strike one. Flight out to center. Kiermaier tracks it down easy, and he'll make the catch for route number three. More traffic, no runs for Houston. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Tampa still looking to try and tie this thing up or more as Rosa Reina will lead off. Fielder, number 27. Swing and a miss. Rifled foul down the third base line and struck him out. Another K for Valdez as a Rosarena's downswing. That'll bring up Brandon Lowe. One and one. And now two and one. And through the right side for a base hit. Lowe's got himself a single. Two one. Pitch that was, and he puts it in to right for a base hit. That'll bring up Zanino with a tying run on first. Zanino's got a big swing. We'll see if he can put something together here. One two pitch from Valdez. He struck him out. Another strikeout for Valdez as Kiermeyer steps in with two outs and a runner on. Nine K's through four and two thirds for Valdez. And Kiermaier pops it up. Maldonado's got a read, and that'll do it. Tampa struggling to put any offense together here. We head to the sixth. Houston still in the lead with Alvarez, Brantley, and Pena due up here. The left number 44. He puts it on the ground for Lowe, who will throw it over to first in plenty of time for out number one. Alvarez is retired to lead off. And here is Michael Brantley. And he 
puts it on the ground. Caballero deep in the hole. The throw across is in time. Another nice play by Caballero. It's short. And there is quickly two down here as Pena steps up to face Rasmussen. And he puts it on the ground for a pitch. Caballero once again will throw across, and that'll do it. One, two, three, go the Astros in the six. We head to the bottom half. Caballero, Diaz, Margot do up. Now batting the shortstop, number seven. Three and O on Caballero. And he puts it into Pena, who gloves it. The throw across is in time. A nice scoop by Cruz. And they rob Caballero of a hit there. Diaz rifles one into left center. What a diving play by McCormick! Back to back, outstanding defensive plays by the Astros as Diaz is robbed of a hit now. In steps Margot with two down. What a play out there by Chaz McCormick. Two and two, the count on Margot. Here's the pitch. Fouled off. Gonna do it again. Another foul ball. Another two two. Popped up. Under it is Valdez. And for out number three, he's got it. Top of the seventh, it is a pitcher's duel here in Tampa. one nothing Astros as they look to try to get some insurance. Rasmussen with just 73 pitches thrown will stay in the ball game here to start the seventh. Bregman taps it and over the head of Lowe who couldn't get, make the diving catch. Bregman has himself a single, and that'll bring up Chaz McCormick, the leadoff man aboard. That outstanding play in center by McCormick, robbing Diaz of potentially extra bases, but he taps it on the ground. Caballero, low, not in time to get the double play. It'll be a fielder's choice. McCormick is aboard, and that is a fast runner over there. And he takes off on the first pitch. The throw, not in time. Double play opportunity goes away, and he's going to try to take third. Here's the throw. They got him! Zanino with the dart to tag McCormick at third. And Maldonado is down swinging for strike three. That'll do it in the seventh as Houston spoils a golden opportunity. Bottom of the seventh. one nothing Astros as the Rays are running out of time to claw back into this thing as Valdez is rolling with nine strikeouts. Sampson behind, 0-2 after a couple of foul balls. Trying a battle. High fly ball, deep center field. Watching it as McCormick, it's gone. A home run for Al Sampson and we are tied. 429 feet into the plants in center field, and we are all tied up as Al Sampson rifles one out of here. That'll bring up Harold Ramirez as Valdez gives up his first run of this ball game. Shot down the left field line and foul by about 15 feet. The 0-2 to Ramirez. Tapped on the ground, Altuve on the nifty hop, and he makes a good play for out number one. Now Rosarena with one down. Just high, here's the 2 1. Sky to center field. McCormick racing in, Pena out, and Pena will make the catch in. Pretty much center field there for out number two. Low up with two down, one for two with a single. 90 pitches now for Valdez, imagining that this will probably be his last inning. Trying to fan low the pitch, fouled off. Gonna 
do it again. On the ground, and Altuve couldn't dive for it. That one's into center field for a base hit. Low with his second hit of this ball game, and another runner on for Tampa as Zanino steps to the plate. Number 10. Valdez stays in to face him. On the ground and a foul ball down the third base line. 1 2 on Zanino. Here's the pitch. He struck him out. Another strikeout for Valdez to end the seventh inning. We head to the top of the eighth. 1 1 tie. As Altuve will dig in. 1 for 3 with a double. Rasmussen, seven innings, 82 pitches. He will start off the eighth against Altuve. one against Tuve. Here's the pitch. A little flare that'll get fouled down the first baseline in right field. 2-2 two -two now. The pitch. Off. High fly to center. Kiermaier backing up. And he will have room to make the catch just at the edge of the warning track. Number 61. Altuve is retired. That'll bring up Cruz. They're going to leave in Rasmussen to face him. And he's ahead. 2-0. -oh. Here's a pitch. Grounded over to short. Caballero. He'll make the throw in time for out number two. Two down. Here's Tucker. And Jason Adam will step into the game here to face Tucker. The losing pitcher in last night's game, but grounds it to Caballero first pitch. And that'll do it in the eighth here for Houston. 1-1 one, one the score after seven and a half. Kiermaier, Caballero, Diaz. All hitless, but they're due up in this inning. G-Man Choi will pinch hit for Kiermaier for the second straight game, actually. In to face the lefty, Valdez. Rifled foul. Swing and a miss. He's behind 0-2, though. Here's the pitch. And a jumping catch by Bregman for out number one to rob Manchoy of a hit. And that'll do it for Valdez. Montero will step in to face Caballero, who is 0-3 on this ballgame. The 0-2. Down low. 1-2 pitch. Fouled off. Do it again. Popped up. Shallow right. Altuve out for this one, and he will make the catch for out number two. And with two down, here's Yandy Diaz. Two and one. Yes, fouls are off. 2-2 two, two the count now. Tough guy to fan. Here's a pitch. High fly. Right field. Tucker under it, and he will make the catch for out number three as Diaz flies out. We head to the top of the ninth. 1-1 one, one the score as Adam will be getting back to work here. Low takes over in center for the second straight game. Adam ahead, 0-2 on Alvarez, here's the pitch. Struck him out on three pitches, Jason Adam, fans one of the MVP favorites. And here's Michael Brantley with the leadoff man retired. And that one's up the middle, solidly stroke for a base hit. Lowe will throw it in. One down here, and the Astros have the winning run. Number three. On first base with Brantley getting aboard for Pena. Adam would love a double play here. Check swing. Pena does not go around. Here's a 1 1. And that one's in the right field for a base hit. It'll roll all the way to the wall. Margot's going to have to get it in quick. Pena looking to get to second base, and he's in there with a double. Runners on second and third with Bregman to the plate. The go-ahead run on third base and only one out. 
Adam looking for a strikeout. He's ahead 0-2 on Bregman. He struck him out! Caught looking is Bregman on three pitches, and here is McCormick with two down and the go-ahead run on third base. Popped up! Shallow infield. Under it is low. He will make the catch. Tampa gets out of it. We head to the bottom of the ninth, tied 1-1. Manuel Margot to the plate, and Kanan will pinch hit for him. Kanan without a plate appearance in the postseason. This is his first. Swing and a miss. Here's the one two to Kanan. Caught him looking, strike three. That'll bring up Al Sampson. The game tying home run, his last time up. Foul. The one two. Way inside. Got a piece. On the ground, Bregman diving stop. The throw across is in time for out number two. Sampson rounds out for out number two, and that will bring up Harold Ramirez with two down. Trying to keep this inning going. He sharply lines it to center. McCormick under it. He'll make the catch. And that will do it. We are heading to extras. Here in the 10th, Maldonado Altuve Cruz do up. Aledemus Diaz will pinch hit for Maldonado. Low to right field, and Kanan will take over at second. 0 2 on Diaz. Side. One two pitch. Just got a piece and fouls it off. Do it again. And again, Diaz staying alive. Just low, check the swing. On the ground, Sampson over to first. Route number one. Altuve now at the plate. With one down. Wave and a miss at the changeup. Adam's still at work. Here is Yo2. Way outside for ball one. Pitch. Two and two now. Popped up. Getting under it is Caballero, and that is out number two. Francis Cruz, the man of the hour. He's been on fire in this series, and he is the two out hitter here in the top of the tenth for Houston as Adam. Looks to be about to cross 30 pitches, but here's the 0-2. He struck him out! Adam, a redemption game. No runs for Houston. We head to the bottom of the 10th. 1-1 the score. A Rosa Arena to lead off this inning. Diaz takes over at first. They move Cruz to catcher. Two and one, the count. Swing and a miss. Here's the payoff. On the ground, diving stop. Couldn't glove it as Pena, and that will be an infield single for Rosarena. The right fielder, number eight. Montero stays in to face Brandon Lowe. Taking off. And safe over there is a Rosarena with a stolen base. 0-2 on low. Here's a pitch. Swing and a miss at the breaking ball way inside for out number one. That'll bring up Zanino. Looking for a base hit here with the winning run on second. And check down to second base and there safely is a Rosarena. 1-1. One, one. Fouled off. Sanino trying to stay alive. Here's the 1 2 pitch. Line to center field, dropping, but McCormick will make the catch. Good run down there to prevent a base hit. That'll bring up Josh Lowe with two down and the winning run on second base. Knee 
need a base hit here. Tampa Bay trying to stay alive in this series and force a game three. Here is the one two to low. On the ground, Montero gloves it, and that is out number three. Top of the 11th, 1-1. One, one. Tampa can't capitalize. We stay tied. And here is Kyle Tucker as Adam will stay in the game. Tucker 0 for 4. Two-two. Good pitch from Adam. He caught him looking strike three. Adam threw three innings of relief. And will stay in to face Alvarez, who's two for four with two singles. Excuse me, two and two thirds. Thought he had made it to three, not yet. In the air, left field, backing up is it on the wall, and that will bounce off the wall. Alvarez digging for two as a Rosarena couldn't glove it, and he is in there. A one-out double for Alvarez puts the go-ahead run on second. Adam stays in to face Brantley. This will be his 40th pitch, and it is low for ball two. Three and one the count on Brantley. Here's the pitch. Caballero with a nifty glove flip for the catch, and that is out number two. Here's Pena. And Adam, with 42 pitches thrown, will continue to throw here. Pena swings and misses at the first offering. It's 0-1. And, and fouled off down the right field line. 0-2. The pitch fouled off again. Pena staying alive. Ball one. One two pitch from Adam to Pena. Down low once again. On the ground through the right side for a base hit. Alvarez is being waved home low. Bobbles it. And Houston leads two to one. I am amazed that they stuck with Jason Adam there. He had thrown over 40 pitches and that puts the Astros on top and now three outs away from advancing to the ALDS with Pena's RBI single. Wow. Pena taking off. The throw down to second is not in time. Pena has himself a stolen base. Whistler facing Bregman. That one a long way, but foul. The 0-2. Down low. In the center, that one's gonna fall for a hit. Pena's being waved home. Lowe's throw is not in time. It's three to one, Houston, now. Now batting, the center fielder, number 30. Follow. One and one, the count on McCormick. And he lines it to center. Low will get to it, and that'll be out number three. Ray's trail by two after Adam gives up a pair of runs. Caballero will lead off. He's 0 for 4. Siri will take over for the defense in left. And Dubon at second over Altuve. And lined in the center field for a hit on the first pitch. McCormick will get it in in time. And that is... A disconnect, excuse me. Wait for this to load, all right. Now pitching number Javier will take over for Montero. Pitched about three innings of relief in last night's game. He'll face Diaz after a leadoff single. And that one right to Diaz, the throw over, they're gonna get a double play! Lead off base hit erased. And with two down, Houston now just one out away with Kanan at the plate as the last hope for Tampa. The 0-2 pitch. He struck him out! And Houston, in two games, is gonna advance to the ALDS Tampa sweeped at home.
Get swept, excuse me. Goodness, I can't talk. But Houston wins it here in Tampa Bay. That is going to do it as the Astros will advance in 11 and move on to face the Toronto Blue Jays in the ALDS. 3-1, to one, your final. Jason Adam tagged with both losses in this series, and that is going to do it. Houston advances to the ALDS. The Rays eliminated three straight losses. They lost the tiebreaker game against Toronto and lose both of the wildcard games at home against the Astros. And Javier with the save. That'll do it for the first of the wildcard series. Wildcard series number one of two in the AL. I'm Caden Reif. On behalf of everybody who probably watched this, maybe not, I have no idea what I'm even saying anymore. We'll catch you next time. It'll be one of the NLDS next, or NLC, good lord, NL wildcard series. Ugh, I'm stumbling over my words. We'll catch you then, and as always, have yourself a good one.